Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. So this is the official, official podcast interview. And happy Saturday to everybody. Sean White, founder and creator of Transformation Greatness, coming to you as far as with another installment with the Small Business Network podcast. And we have been rocking and rolling. I tell you, we have been on fire today, guys. I mean, the show, the TV show, we absolutely rocked that with the Small Business Network. That was fantastic. A lot of great value and information. We had here our co-host, Miss Helen Clueless. She did an amazing job as far as with episode 31. And now, boys and girls, you have a special treat on episode number 32. I get the beautiful honor of interviewing the founder and owner of the Small Business Network, Dr. James McConnell, his son, Mr. Champion Riddick, which, by the way, is one of our rising stars. He is a music artist. He is someone that has a lot of many different talents, along with his sister, Garcia Power. So this is going to be a treat, guys. And do me a favor as you're tuning in. If you catch this on the live, put it in hashtag live. Let me know where you guys exactly tuning in from. If you know me, I love as far as for interaction. I love the engagement. And we most certainly appreciate all, all of your comments, which is all, always insightful. And if you're catch, happy to be catching this on a replay, then put it in the hashtag replay as well. And this is going to be amazing. So a little bit more about myself before we go ahead and get rocking and rolling. Then I'll be able to add in our very special guest because it's all about him. So I'm the founder and creator of Transformation Greatness, which is all about motivating, encouraging, and inspiring the masses. And with that, my brand is threefold. So I'm a speaker, a coach, as well as a hypnotherapist. In addition, I am the founder, I'm sorry, not the founder, but partner and CEO of the network along with my dear Dr. James McConnell. And simply what that is, that's a community and a platform in which that we give entrepreneurs, um, those that have a passion, a vision, an opportunity to really showcase themselves and by using the power of TV and radio. So it's something, boys and girls, as you're listening in, if you would love to be a part of this, we would love to go ahead and um, have a conversation with you. And with that being said, we have the man the hour. First of all, we have here Dr. James McConnell in attendance, but we also have here my main man, our rising star, Mr. Champion. First of all, I like the sound of that name, Champion Rick. What's going on, brother? I'm doing good. All right, all right, all right. So before we go ahead and get started, I gotta ask the question. I just gotta ask the question. Every single time I see you, always like it's like you're mad, you <laughs> mean mother. What what what's up with, with, with that champ? Talk to me, man. What's up with that? That like that's just like my default face expression. <laughs> like, like yeah, that's just my default face expression. Like that's all that is. Okay, okay. I mean, hey, I definitely, you know, respect that. You got to show up as like, you know what, I'm, I'm serious. I'm about my business. I ain't the one, right? Right. Okay, cool, cool. All right, all right, champ. I got you. I got you. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. I'm just here to interview you. <laughs> so let's go ahead and, and get this started. So if you can just let the listener audience know a little bit, what's, what's your name? Uh, my name is uh, Campion McConnell. All right, cool, cool, cool. And, and Riddick McConnell. All right, awesome. And who is your dad and as well manager? Who manages you? His name is uh, James McConnell. Dr. Oh. James McConnell. <laughs> doctor, that's right. That's very, very important. we got to make sure the doctor, we most certainly got to give him that, you know, respect for sure. Champion. I know as far as that you're a music artist, and by the way, you're very talented as well, my brother. What kind of music do you um, sing or you enjoy, like, playing? Music I kind of, like, to enjoy. Like, kind of, like, maybe, like, video game music. I like that a lot. I'm sorry, say that for me again? Exactly, that's what I said. Like, video game like music. Video game music? Yeah. Give me an example of what you mean by video game music, because it may be certain people in the audience they may not be familiar as far as what you mean by video game music. 
I mean, R and B, but I mean, yeah, video game music. That's basically what it's like. Certain um, pieces that would be played in certain video games I like to play. Oh, okay. Any kind of particular video games? I guess like for the video game heads out here. Uh, kind of like Genshin Impact. That's another. That's a good one. They have a lot of good music in there. You said Future Impact. Uh, Genshin Impact. Oh, Genshin Impact. Yeah. Okay. So for all you uh, video game, you know, lovers out there, I'm not familiar with that. But if you are, then you know what he's talking about. It's, it's it sounds good though. Cool. And what song is actually coming out soon? Song is coming out soon. Is uh, everyone's watching me? Everyone's watching. I like that. That's right. Right, everyone's watching. That's what I'm talking about. And what do you normally sing with? I'm sorry. Yeah. What song? I'm sorry. What 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 do you normally sing with? Or I or, or, or I guess in other words, I think that as far as like um when you're singing, what instrument do you do you use? I guess. Oh, just sing. He said what instrument? Uh, you said what instrument I play with? Well, the question was, what what do you normally sing with? Uh, who do I sing with? Right. I have my uh, sister, uh, Lawson. Nice. Okay. Cool. Cool. Or also, so, you know, known as Garcia Farra. All right. Awesome. So basically, it's a fan, uh, a dynamic duo, you would say. There. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. So before you move forward, I just want to say hello as far as to our audience here. So we have here Mr. Roosevelt Russell in the building, and we also have the amazing and fantastic Miss Loretta Ward in the building. Welcome, guys, to the Small Business Network podcast. This is episode 32 with our amazing guest and rising star, Mr. Campion Rick. Welcome, welcome. So, other than singing, my friend, what else do you like, like, like to do normally, like on your spare time, when you're not recording and making hits? I'm sorry? Other than singing, right, or other than recording, what else do you like to do in your spare time? Uh, I usually like to play video games, stuff like that. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Any particular favorite game, again, for... The video game heads out there. Any favorite one? Favorite one? Uh, I like a lot of games. I don't think I have a favorite, really. Okay. So whatever you just in the mood for, you just go ahead and play and rock out, correct? Yeah. All right. Cool, cool. Cool, cool. This is some good stuff here. Good stuff here. This is something I'm very interested in because I see – as far as like with, with a lot of your um, songs and whatnot, that you play several different instruments. So, how many instruments can you actually play, my friend? Like five. Oh, nice. Can we get a list of the instruments that you play? I play uh, bass guitar, electric guitar, acoustic. I play the piano, as well as um actually, if you know, finna start learning uh, the violin. As well as the uh, saxophone. Is that right? Yeah. Ooh, multi talented. That's what I'm talking about. That is exciting. And guess, guess, guess how many instruments that I can play? How many? Zero. <laughs> <laughs> Absolute zero. But no, uh, on a serious note, I remember when I was younger, I, I had like a fascination as far as with the drums. But the thing was, I never. I was stuck with it. Only thing I used to just do is make a whole bunch of noise as far as with the drums. And, you know, I used to play a little bit of keyboard, you know, back in the day, but I never stuck with it. So for the fact that you can play like six instruments, that's something else, man. Yeah. That's a beautiful thing. So this is something in which that I'm curious with. Why, why do you seem so quiet at, at, at times? Well, I seem so quiet. Yeah. <laughs> no, like it's just kind of me, I guess. Like I don't, like I don't really be talking a lot. Wait, hold on. I'm sorry, I did, but just a lot. It's like I'm buzzing in the background. I'm sorry, I I didn't catch that. I I was saying that um, that's just kind of me, I guess. Like I really like, I just don't like talk that much. 
Oh, okay. So you pretty much kind of a low key kind of guy, but when the lights come on, you know, you just go out and you just do your thing, right? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. See, that's quiet storm right there for you guys. You don't say too much, but when he do, everybody's listening. I like that. I totally respect that. You know something, my, my brother, man? This has been a long time in the making. I know I have spoken to your dad, and I've spoken very highly of you, and I just said, man, it would be so cool to get an opportunity to speak to, you know, a rising star, man, a trendsetter, man. So you are doing, you know, beautiful and amazing things, you and your sister. So I guess, like, for the last minute or so, do you have anything that you would like to add, anything you would like for your listening audience to know? Anything. The floor is yours. I guess what I'll say is like, you know, if you like, if you want to do some, like say, like do what I do, just stick to it, just keep doing what you're doing, and you know, make it. You heard that, folks? Wisdom. Which, by the way, you you can learn that from anyone. Age doesn't have anything to do with it. You can learn from everybody. So with that being said, folks, that's all that we got for you. This wraps up episode 32 from the Small Business Network podcast with my main man over here to my right, Mr. Campion Riddick. You can find him as well as his sister, Garcia Power, coming to you very, very soon. And remember that name. They will be a household name. And I said it, and so shall it. So until then, guys, if what we say on here either motivated, transformed, or inspired at least one person, at least one person, then may God be the glory, and we take no credit for absolutely none of it. I want to thank my special guest here, Mr. Campion Riddick, along with his dad, Dr. James McConnell, my um, partner and, and also mentor and good friend. You guys are doing exceptional work. and. We look forward as far as to taking this straight up to, to the top. So until then, family, thank you so much for your time. And look forward for episode 33 of the Small Business Network podcast with my main man here, also in attendance, Mr. Roosevelt Russell, as he's going to break it down and give you the goods. Until then, have a blessed one. Take care, family. Thank, thank you. you.